Good morning. It is Saturday. A happy day. I am about to leave for my session. I just need to grab snacks. Snacks. Now I'm gonna open the blinds actually. My skin is desperately in need of some extraction. Oh, dang it, not again. Did it. Oh my god, my legs are so sore. Put on my socks. I also have to take my pills, but I don't have water. I don't get water. My legs are so sore. That's crazy how sore they are. But I did like gua sha yesterday and like my legs. And uh, it helped with the tightness that I had. Okay, I think I have a little bit of time. Um, my appointment is at 9.30. I thought it was at 9, but it's at 9.30. And it's currently... I hate it when it turns into this analog clock because it takes me a while to read the time. It's 8.25. So I have like an hour, um, but I mean I have to get out here, get out of here in like 10 minutes, 15 minutes. Because sometimes the train is very unreliable during the weekends. Let me get water, take my pills, and then leave. Changed my hat. So I think the black is better, the purple, and like this bag and like my black pants, it was just too much color. Let's take my pails, it's Saturday. I'm also quite hungry. to get there. There's also a bookstore right next door to... It's called the Rizzoli Bookstore and it's really pretty. Oh, but they open at 11. I kind of want to go. If it's open, I'll go. But it's really nice. I bought, like, my books there. Um... So maybe after my facial, if it's open, I'll go, but I think my facial, I'll be done. It's usually an hour, so 10.30, so it might not be open. We'll see. Oh wait, I wanted to try, what was that stationery store? Oh, they open at 12. Niko Neko Sakaya. It's like this cute Japanese store. In East Village, they open at 12, though. Yeah, so apparently, I don't have to go to, um, there is, I don't have to go all the way to, to Central Park to see the cherry blossoms. There's a place that you can go and see in Brooklyn, in Prospect Park. That's in Brooklyn, so I'll do that tomorrow then. Productions. So this is what it, the map looks like from church to Prospect Parts. All right, sounds good. Okay, I gotta go. I'll be back. This is my before. Hopefully she is flattened. My face is raw, but glowing. She got all of the extractions in this guy. So, excited for tomorrow. Bit of plans. It's raining outside. <laughs> so, I was gonna order laundry service, but apparently they don't pick up today. They pick up tomorrow and deliver Monday, but Actually, I think this Monday I don't have to 
um, be in the office. It's like starting next week. So I think that's fine actually. So a little bit early, but I'd rather just do get it done and over with. But I also don't understand like the weather because I thought it was getting warmer. So I only wore this, like I have nothing underneath. And it's freaking cold outside. Like it's so windy, rainy. It's cold. It's like in the 40s. Like what? Wasn't it just warming up? Like what's going on? Anyways, I'm back from the facial. She did get a lot of the extractions. Um, but it's like still open. Um, so she told me not to do much and just kind of rest. And then tomorrow, depending on like how severe the wounds are, um, I might just stay home and do online service because I don't think I should aggravate my skin with makeup and I don't exactly want to go outside like this, you know, and see people, so. Okay, so I think I'm going to do laundry next week, including my bedding, which means it's going to be three bags. Probably over a hundred bucks. But I can't, I don't want to carry that big load in the rain. I'll still like sort my laundry today so that like next week it'll be easy. Or I could do them this weekend. So let me sort sort my laundry. So I already have one bag. I'm gonna have to have three bags. Do I even have a third bag? But anyways, that's like bedding and then I'll put like towels into this one as well. Second bag. see laundry that is packed. <sighs> so my lights, dark towels, knits. I think I'll put the knits in the towels here and then I think I might be able to like squeeze the darks and the lights into the second bag and I'll only have two bags I'll try it I'm already out of breath look at this mountain small mountains why do I have so many clothes but then also like how do I have nothing to wear like what? Do you think it'll fit? <laughs> Change of plans again. Um, yeah, I'm gonna have to order it today. <laughs> Can't wait until next week. Um, I don't want to do three bags, so yeah, I'll just order it. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Okay, I should probably eat lunch. I am quite hungry and hot. I'm gonna open the windows. It's hot. I'm eating the turkey chili with beans. Microwaved right here. And I'm gonna try not to watch TV while I eat. Um and try like practice like mindful eating. It's one of what my coach has suggested that I try coach slash therapist slash nutritionist let's try it you know who knows maybe I'll enjoy my food better you know pouring my all my attention is focused on eating bon appetit Mm. 
very swassy. I wish I had some bread. It's really good in this. I do not have bread. I'm bored. I want to be on my phone, but no. I must resist. It's not raining now. Gosh. But it is wet. The, the ground is wet. No, it's all, I already ordered it. It's too late. Of course, it's like 10 minutes. Like, I would have had to haul that big bag 10 minutes. It's not worth it. It's not worth my energy. Plus, my legs don't work properly right now. They do a pretty decent job. So... already too late. I can't stop thinking about it. I already ordered. I'm going to make some coconut oat milk. So I have my nutter and I filled it with water, coconut, oatmeal, um, some honey because I don't have any like vanilla extract. Which I always forget to get. Like, I always remind myself, I'm like, okay, I need to go get vanilla extract, and then I forget it. So, anyways, it's fine. Everything's fine. I don't need it. Just need to plug this guy in. I think I'll move that little stand here. Okay. Bad idea. This here. Because the cord for this is quite short. I don't um, make this milk as often. I feel like, why not? You know, I have the time today. Okay, just plug it in and then room temperature is fine. It's so loud.
five milliliters, about one and one fourth cup. And I'm going to put it into this little jug. I'm saving a little bit to taste. Mmm, it's really sweet. I may have put too much honey, but it's really good. Oh my god. Mmm. I can just drink this. Mmm. That's good. Oh man, where did I put my co coffee? I put it on my desk, so I'm gonna put some into my coffee. So here's my cold brew. I'm gonna pour just a splash. Delicious. Delicious. I also bought some stir for my Amazon order game. I bought I bought toilet paper. And this I bought a book. Um I wanted like a bedtime book and my oh my um my trainer slash therapist slash coach recommended that I get this book um to kind of read before bed trying to get into the habit of like um healthy like because I have trouble sleeping and or, like falling asleep and it's because I'm like always on my phone um or playing games or switch before I go to bed um, so she said like maybe switch up the habit so that I'm reading like maybe a couple of minutes and then that just like calms my brain and she recommended this book by Hwang Bodum I guess it's a Korean book welcome to the Hyunnam Dong bookshop yeah I guess it is a Korean book yeah um, oh so it was translated into English I guess this originally was a Korean book beautiful so I'm excited to read this um, I was reading because I have bought like some, some books at the Rizzoli bookstore I bought this this is called Severance by Ling Ma and um, I was reading this before I like fell asleep and like I think it made it worse because this is like despite the cover <laughs> it's actually about the apocalypse or well not apocalypse, but it's more of like, well, kind of. It's like, what if there's like a flu that happens? <laughs> kind of like COVID, but it's like the extreme measures where like, um, there's only like 11 survivors in New York City. <laughs> so um, when I was reading this, it's not that I got nightmares. It's like, I actually like, contemplated like after reading I'm like what if I were in that situation what would I be doing and like how would I be doing like what should I be doing you know so then like my mind was like literally like rushing and so I was having trouble falling asleep <laughs> so this book didn't work out but maybe she said that this book is supposed to be a kind of more calming um book so this will be my bedside book Meanwhile, I think I will like finish reading this because it is interesting. It is. It's very interesting. I also have a couple of other books that I want to read. So when I went to Rizzoli, this is the bookmark that they gave me. Rizzoli Bookstore. It was a beautiful bookstore. 
um, I bought this. And then another book that I bought was this, Crying in H Mart. Here's my receipt. So I do want to read this as well. So I think I'll finish reading this, then start on this. And then I also have another great like bedside boring-ish book. Well, I don't know if it's boring, but I haven't started it. So this book was actually given um, to like by my company. Like when I first signed on, they our CEO once wanted us to read this book called Execution, The Discipline of Getting Things Done. Great motivational book. Um, this will put me to sleep. So, yeah. I have some books. I want to get started on this. These, I will... I need to clear, like, my this area. Like I feel like Jimmy is suffocating. These are my Bose headphones. Okay. And then this is my daily planner that I don't use but I bought and I really want to use it so okay. Maybe I should put this somewhere else. Jimmy is free. Only one one book. And then I just moved it here. Alright, good enough. I'm considering joining a gym. There's a promotion. And the gym looks pretty clean and... I feel like I want to like walk on the treadmill but I don't have a treadmill so... I think it might be good for me. do it. If I commit, if I bite the bullet, I'll go, right? Yeah. One hour later. Okay, you know what? Let's do it. It'll motivate me, right? I'm doing it. I did it. I clicked. I clicked it. I am now a gym member. I did it. There's no going back now. There is, but it's going to be costly. It's an investment on my body. Because today, I barely got in 5,000 steps. So, what did I do? What did I just do? Oh no, what did I just do? I am so sleepy. I'm so sleepy, I don't even think I need to read the book. But I'm gonna... Put this oh my camera's dying then I charge it like this camera battery life is quite terrible I'm pretty sure I charged it all day today well maybe not all day I'm gonna put on this mask and then go to bed it's a jello mask jelly mask I think I need it after that facial.
It's supposed to turn clear um, when it's done. It's one of those masks. Yes. Put this guy on my nose. Feels like an orgy more. <laughs> All right, now we go to bed. Good night. See you in the morning.